Let's graph this piecewise function using Desmos graphing calculator. First, let's start with this quadratic piece, x squared plus four. For values of x less than or equal than one. Notice how you write this condition within braces. That's the way you tell Desmos that the parabola that you need is for values of x less than or equal than one. Let's go ahead with the linear part. Four x minus two now. This is gonna be for values of x between one and three. Not including one, including three, right? Great. Next, let's go ahead with a constant part. Four, for values of x is strictly greater than three. Great. Now, what you see here is the graph of the piecewise function, but now we gotta take care of the endpoints, endpoints, okay? First endpoint here happens at x equal one, pair up with y equal five. So we're gonna add that point here, one comma five. Solid circle, right? It's just that came out in green. I'm gonna change the color to black. Great, done. Now we go ahead with this endpoint. Notice this is for values of x is strictly greater than one, right? One is not included. So the point one comma two should be added, but this should be an empty circle, right? Empty circle. So I'm gonna change the color to red first, and then I'm gonna make the circle an empty circle. Great, done. Go to the next endpoint, corresponds to x equal three, three comma 10 should be a solid circle here, right? Because notice less than or equal than three, three is included. So we're gonna add the point three comma 10. We're gonna change the color to red. And there we have the solid circle. Finally, for the last endpoint, X must be strictly greater than three. So we're gonna add the point three comma four, three comma four, three comma four here. And we just have to make this circle blue and hollow, right? Hollow circle or empty circle. Done. That's all. This is the graph of this piecewise function. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. More videos coming up. Thank you.